Hello everybody, Johnny Lee Long here. I just got something in new today to the shop and I want you guys to see it. I have not, have not done anything to it. I just actually put it in my hand like five minutes ago, okay? Maybe six, maybe six and a half minutes, maybe. All right then. All right, let me take what it is, okay? This is a wart and they call it a thumb base, all right? Let's look at it. I have not done anything to it. I have not been in the shop, through the shop yet. I was about to go out to the shop right now. But this is a thumb base, okay? And I think this is a Pro Series. I think they call Warwick Pro Series thumb bases because they both them. All right, then. But anyway, okay, I just got enough time in it to just um, hear how it sounds. So anyway, all right, I got it on passive mode, so it pushes in and out, in and out. You know how that goes. Okay, so I got it out now, so it's, it's passive mode. And when in passive mode, uh, none of the controls work. None of the bass control works or the treble control work. And it has two pickups, okay? MECs, soap bars. Okay, so let's do the rear pickup first. I'm coming through my uh, TC Electronic um, 250 BG Custom. I did. Thank you. But Zinga. And I got the amp turn kind of down so you can hear how the bass sounds. You know, Warwick has that really distinguished, has his own distinguished sound. All right, so I got that at the rear, now I'm putting it at the front. Okay, uh, both pickups are still in passive mode. <laughs> Nasty. Bazinga! Alright, so let's try again. Alright, so let's go into the active mode. I'm doing this really quick, y'all. So we're in the active mode right now. And with the active mode, let's go to the rear pickup and put the bass at the D10. There's a D10 on the bass. I found it. Ha! D10 is ha! Ah, I did. So rear pickup. Okay, uh, we're in the active mode now. So let's go. Um, let's turn it. Let's turn the uh, rear pick, the front pickup. Okay, both pickups. Okay, let's put the uh, trouble in the half D10, 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 like it. Oh, it's waking up. One thing I know about these bases is, other than being heavy, um, to me, is that they're very clean, very articulate. So if you, if you got an articulate voice in your head, do you have an articulate voice in your head? I do! Okay, so I have a very articulate voice in my head. So I, if I wanted to play something I heard, I, I, want that, I want that bass to play what I hear in my head. Okay, I want to hear that. If I hear it in my head, I want to hear it here. Okay? So let's turn the detent, I mean the bass all the way to bass all the way wide open. Both pickups. Okay? Oh, she's waking up now. Okay? And let's turn the treble all the way. Both pickups. Hear how this bass sounds um, with dead strings because the strings are they're pretty sound pretty dead to me. Uh, it could be bright to somebody else, but they're kind of dead to me because they haven't been through the whole Hobo Depot shop. And you know this, man. Okay.
I think it sounds pretty good to me. So there you have it. Let's look at it again. It is a Warwick Thumb Bass 5 with MECs, push pull, okay, bass and treble, mix. And it's a bolt on. And it has a wing and neck. And there you have it. It's a thumb. Can you see the thumb? Thumb. <gasps> I like thumb. And it has a little bit of war paint. I saw some war paint somewhere. Anywho, my name is Johnny Lee Long. Peace out.